What is the most effective way to ice your migraine? Hi everybody, my name is Dr. Perman. I'm a board certified chiropractic neurologist and I focus primarily on rehabilitative techniques for concussions, dizziness, and migraines. So it's not uncommon when a patient is actively going through a migraine for them to try to ice their migraine. And so many times patients will come in actively going through a migraine and you know, they've got ice on the back of their head or they have ice on the front of their head and they're like, ah, I'm just hoping that this will take the edge off. Well, while there's nothing wrong with icing the back of your head or your forehead for a migraine, there is a better spot for you to hit. We have to remember that the pain we experience as a result of a migraine occurs because of an abnormal dilation of our blood vessels. The reason why ice has the potential to reduce your pain when you're going through a migraine is because the ice will constrict those blood vessels and take the pain down a little bit. We have to remember that the pain that we experience with a migraine tends to sit behind one or both of your eyes. So we have to think, where is the blood supply that is going to eventually get to those areas? So yeah, you can absolutely ice the back of your neck. That is going to help with the musculoskeletal component of your migraine. And you can ice the top of your head here because that's close to the blood vessels that are involved with migraine. But the one area that everybody forgets to ice as a migraine patient when you're actively going through a migraine is the front of the neck. We have very important arteries going through the front of our neck here called the carotid arteries. And those are the primary arteries that are supplying blood to the areas of the head where we experience our migraine pain. So the next time that you experience a migraine, absolutely ice the back of your head, ice the front of your head up here, but do not forget to wrap an ice pack around the front of your neck as well and see if that helps take the pain down a little bit more.